Hey Milk Riders, it's time for some more VGC. And it looks like we're starting off with going against uh, Electabuzz and also the Ice Horse over here. Still using the staple remover team, the Archaludon, um, the team creator will be in the description as always. Let's see, they do have a Lando, which is scary. Um, Electabuzz, I wonder if that gets <clears throat> Lightning Rod? Urshifu, there's Ice Horse, Furgraph, so we have to be careful about priority moves, and then Primarina. Okay. Hmm. Just say if we do... I mean, we could just go Torn. Saber Remover. Um, we have, like, Flash Cannon, Draco Meter that could hit uh, the Lando. Also, just be a little bit weary of Electro Shot. I don't want to boost up the Electabuzz. Um, they have Shifu. And the Ice Horse kind of scares me away from Landorus. Fergraf probably sets up Trick Room, so that's probably coming out first. I think we're gonna leave Urshifu back just since it is Choice Scarfed, and I feel like mm, we're not. Maybe we should have brought a Moongus because Ice Horse is slow. Primarina's uh, pretty slow. Uh, Electabuzz. I do want to see if it gets. I'm pretty sure it gets Lightning Rod. Uh, it does it. It gets Static and Vital Spirit, unless if Lightning Rod is a new... Okay, yeah, so no Lightning Rod, so don't have to be worried about that. They go Lando Electabuzz. I'm just kind of curious as to what, like, this Electabuzz is gonna do. No for a graph, so... Unless if this gets Trick Room. No, it doesn't. Okay. Um... It could have Thunder, I guess. Say we're gonna rain dance and uh, I think we're just gonna tear a grass and then go for the flash cannon um, I guess we necessarily didn't need a rain dance we could have gone for a tailwind <laughs> no, I'm just checking it outside <laughs> so cute. okay so we're going Terra Grass. Uh, I kind of scared if they have Ice Horse in the back. Okay. Taunt. So. Okay. So our Terra wasn't bad. We'll get a defense boost. And then now we have to go for a bleak wind. Since we're taunted, we can't. Um... I don't know if bleak wind gets a knockout for that though. What does Electabuzz get? I kind of want to make sure this Lando's gone. Well. Yeah, we'll just go... Ah, I don't know. Maybe we should have gotten rid of the Lando. Um, okay, okay. Taunt, follow me. Liquid will hit both, so that's nice. Oh, that knocks out Lando. Love to see that. So I do want to see Bleak Wind on the Lando. <laughs> All right. Okay, so Fergraf is here. So they could set up Trick Room for whatever is in the back. Right, we just gotta go for the Bleak Wind. That's about all we can do. We could go for the Electro Shot. They can't change weather. I'm assuming they're gonna follow me again. I 
don't really want a Draco. What do we have in the back? Ensign. We also have Arlando. Okay. Which is Electroshot. We'll also see how much it does too. Yeah, that's the... Follow me. It could also have screens. I'm like taking a look at uh, Electabuzz. Move so they get light screen. Okay, let's see how much this does to Electabuzz. We did get that special attack boost. This is solid. Hmm. <clears throat> so Furgoff could go for a psychic noise, a dazzling gleam. Um... Oh, this is going to be our last turn of taunt. Okay. We'll do that, and then I'll just go for another, another Electro Shot. We can't protect. <clears throat> if they clear the field, then that's... Oh, they're still just going for follow me. Okay, there's a Dazzling Gleam, but... I just feel like Dazzling Gleam, even if they tear a fairy their Furrigroth isn't- it's not doing much. We do have Electabuzz, so we'll be able to see if they have Ice Horse, Primarina, or Urshifu. Furrigroth's in the red. Speed drop. Okay. Furrigroth's gonna have that Citrus. Mm-hmm. So, we're not taunted anymore. Very nice. If it's Ice Horse, oh. We just gotta keep... We just gotta keep Incineroar, okay. They could Terra it. They could Terra it. Um, right now, Ice Horse could go... Let's see, we protect. There's three more turns of Trick Room, so we could... We do have a defense boost. We have two actually, right? Yeah. Hmm. Kind of tempted to see how much Dorado may die, but if we we'll be able to protect Torn twice. Um. Okay, there's our defense boost coming in. Now we're at plus three. This body press they didn't Terra. Oh, does Zeraladon die from this, actually? Ah, we do. That's okay. Ice school crash. We will... Ice horse didn't get the knockout, so it's not gonna get the little boost. We could rain dance again. Really don't want to. They want to swap in Ensign. And, oh, it's clear amulet. Uh, so we can't fake out because Furigroth is out here. I really don't want to rain dance. But Torn's not really doing anything if they were to like knock us out then that's okay. Guess we just go for a bleak wind. Go for the knockoff on Frigraph. They're gonna Terra. Instant and Lando. Once we can sell out the Trick Room Terrifier. Okay. I guess we could try to knock off <clears throat> the Clear Amulet. Okay. Cinnara with the berry, love to see it. We'll get this bleak wind going. Okay, knockoff knocks out the further up, which is nice. So now it's gonna be three on this ice horse. Bleak wind hits. 
is a good chunk. Okay. <clears throat> I'm gonna protect with Torn. Do we think they go for another stomping tantrum? They could go for an ice cold crash. Another stomping tantrum is not gonna knock us out. So we could knock off the um, last year. Let's see about getting that clear amulet gone. Okay, they did go for another stomping, but. We're gonna... Trick room is over. Since they're Terra Fire, they've been going for ground. Their clear amulet's gone. We'll just go for another Bleak Wind. And then we'll, we'll party shot out of here. You know, torn hit. I, I guess we could have just gone for the knockoff. But if they ice go crush the torn, that's okay. They are at minus one. We'll have Landers here, and if they went for a stomping tantrum into Incineroar, uh, that will not affect Landers. So that'll be nice. Okay, yeah, there's the ice go crash, uh, which means we'll be able to get Incineroar here. Ah. Uh, yeah. Because the chilling egg gets rid of that, so. We should have just doubled into it. We saw Knockoff did a good amount. And if Bleak One missed there, that would have sucked. Um, but yeah, having Landers in the back is really good. Especially since this thing went- like, Incineroar Landers in the back was good going against Ice Horse because if they didn't Terra, we have Flare Blitz to it for super effective. And if they did, uh, there's Landris, so. Very solid. Very solid. Is that Electabuzz? Kinda interesting. Kinda interesting. I wish we were able to see what their Primarina was. Um, but, you know. Electabuzz taunt? Follow me. I wonder what the other moves were. Very interesting. Uh, Volt Switch. Probably pretty solid. They could have had... I don't think their team would have utilized Rain Dance. Uh, no, not bad first first battle today. Let's go. Ooh, double Genie Urshifu, Fluttermane, and then they have the Dragonite and Saber Tooth. <clears throat> Dragonite Saber, always a scary duo. Lando, Fluttermane, Urshifu, and Torn. Lando's also just very scary. We haven't been able to really utilize it this this week so far, but the the Saber Remover, the Archer Ludon, has been incredible. Um, just say if they go Dragonite Saber. Kinda sucks bringing Torn against Saber. Hmm. I mean, we just go. So they get extreme speed. I don't know. Maybe if we go Torn Urshifu. I'm thinking we just <clears throat> Tailwind and then we can attack pretty much anything. Saber Mover is good against Fluttermane. Um, the Urshifu, if we've got the rain up. And then maybe go Landorus. Maybe so. I'm not too sure about this one. Not too sure. I guess Incineroar wouldn't have been a bad lead either. Um, because we could have kind of timid it off on the saber, faked out something. Yeah. Dragonite Saber is. We got two very common leads here. If 
They got Sucker Punch Extreme Speed and Urshifu. Uh, does that get the knockout? Like in that case, would we have to Tailwind? We can't protect our Shifu. Okay, I think we're just gonna go for the Rain Dance. And we'll go for the Surging Strikes. Okay, they're also gonna tear. I feel like an Extreme Speed, a Terra Normal Extreme Speed Sucker Punch is coming to, um, to our Shifu. And if it gets a knockout, you know, we'll see what we can do. We'll see what we can do. There's the extreme speed. Oh, into the torn. Dang. Hmm. That's just not gonna get the knockout. Wow. We would have Terra Water there, but I don't think I would have wanted to. Yeah, that didn't do much. Okay. Terra normal. Huh. I'm gonna bring in Lando. Drilladon could resist that extreme speed. Um I keep saying Drilladon, but <sighs> It's just the part that sucks. Um, okay, so extreme speed into Urshifu. Like I feel like that's the end of Urshifu. Would you like to keep Urshifu or Lando? And if they have their Urshifu. I mean, I guess we're gonna have to go for it. Saber. Okay, yeah, into Urshifu. Yeah, I figured that was going to knock us out. Okay. Sword. Oh, we're just barely not getting these KOs. Um, we can't protect, but we, against Saber, Dragonite, we need a better lead. That's for sure. What is Lando's Terra Poison? We may have to Terra Lando. We may have to Terra Lando. Go for the flash cannon there. Terra here. And I guess we try and go for the Sand Seer Storm. I guess we try. Yeah, what could we have. Maybe leading Incineroar would have been better. Possible. Incin lead. We get that stamina boost. Uh, I think his saber's faster than Lando, so. Big bad sad. But if Lando can hit the double sand seer, the knockout on both. Um... <laughs> the only thing is, if they have their Lando, I. Well, we could sludge bomb it. Um, or torn, but. We got two knockouts. We knocked out the dragon and the saber. Maybe... Huh. Like, yeah, Incineroar. I don't know who would... There's Torn. And is it their Urshifu? Oh, it's their Torn and Lando. They got genies in the back. Ugh. The big thing that sucks about genies in the back is the fact that um, we're we're now weak to 
better though. And Lando is a powerhouse. Lando is a powerhouse. Yeah, this one we definitely just needed a better lead. Possible Ensign lead. We could have done like, um, Ensign. Maybe even just Ensign Duraludon. Like that Extreme Speed wasn't doing much. Um, possible Ensign plus um, Staple Remover lead against Dragonite Saber. Because that would have also been pretty good against Fluttermane. Um, it would just be the Torn Lando and Urshifu that would be kind of kind of iffy if they led like Torn Urshifu. Um, but not about all. We know next time we see a Dragon Saber and think they're going to be out in the lead. Uh, let, we can try instant staple remover. We can try that and see how it goes. Ooh, uh, Dragapult. We haven't seen one of those in a while. Dragapult Talonflame. Mammo. <clears throat> the eel. The electric eel. Backscalibur and a Rangaroo. Our, so Talonflame could have Tailwind. I don't think Mammo Swine's slow. So I'm not too sure if a Rangaroo is just their Trick Room counter that they could just like unset Trick Room or if they wanted to lead a Rangaroo to try and get Trick Room going. Uh, I think Incineroar is nice. We could fake out pretty much everything except the um, Drag Bolt. Um, I guess possibly a Rangaroo if it's got Inner Focus instead of Telepathy. But seen as like Mamoswine. Um, Mamoswine probably has Earthquake, so I think like having the Genius would be pretty solid. We can match Tailwind. Um, I think Landers is good. And then we could just go Staple Remover. And if we're thinking the Mamo, just sex with our Ice. Uh, you know, maybe Moongus would have been better. Maybe so, but we need to handle the... Mamoswine. To me, that's the big threat. And then be just a little wary of Backscalibur in the back so we really can't Flare Blitz um, with Incineroar as... Um... As much as we want to, but Lando I. And this one's oblivious and beautiful. Our other mon is staple remover. Okay. <clears throat> so we can match their tailwind. Does oblivious get them away from also fake out? We'll match Tailwind. Talonflame's gonna upper hand, so I guess not. Oh my god. With the Tailwind going, so they'll offset it by one. Sashed? Okay. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. So, we did get our Tailwind up. They could also Tailwind right now. We don't have any priority, which is a little unfortunate. Um, but we'll go into Lando. And... Uh, I'm not too sure how fast... If we Terra Water... Terra Poison, no. Terra Grass. I think we'd rather keep that. So yeah, maybe we do Terra Water and then... Terra Water. We'll just knock off the Mamoswine just in case the... Um... Well, we'll just Sludge Bomb. I'm thinking Lando's faster, so... Uh... Um... 
And then we'll be able to knock off the town thing. So I guess Oblivious doesn't... problem to knock out the memo swine beautiful because we don't want to deal with that did we have to tear our water in center art probably not now but I wasn't too sure we knocked off Did we not knock off? Is an Electros we can't hit it with? It has levitate, yeah. Um. Yeah, we'll just go for the Sludge Bomb. We'll see how that goes. I. I kind of don't want an electric attack going into um, <clears throat> incense since we did Terra Water. That was big, bad, sad. That's two shot. It's got a berry, um, which means kind of close. Be kind of close. Acrobatics. A crit. What do you use? Giga Drain? I think so. Some drain move. But we'll get the defense boost here, which is going to be very nice. Um, Electro Shot's a two turn attack. Since we don't have the rain. We could just try and go for like a body press. Yeah, we'll double into Electros. We know we're faster. There's going to be one turn. And I believe it might be the next turn that they'll have Tailwind. Um, and we won't. Meaning that they will probably be faster. Okay. Acrobatics there. Okay, so Electros is gone. Either Bexcalibur or Ringer or Dragapult. Yeah, our Tailwind's gone. Which means they have one turn of Tailwind. I don't even know... It's back to Oliver. Um... What was... We think back to Oliver's faster? They haven't Terrored, right? So I think we're just swapping to Incineroar. We do have like a defense boost. What has Talonflame been doing? Um, actually, how are our defenses? We have one defense boost. We could body press that and then swap an ensign. Um. Because if Talonflame is only going for acrobatics, it's not going to do too much to Stable Remover. I'm glad we Terrored Ensign, um, because we wouldn't have Terrored Stable Remover. There's the acrobatics. Beautiful. Glaive Rush. Nice. See that stamina boost. I do think we just parting shot its life orb backs. Beautiful. We don't even need a parting shot at the backs. We don't even need to. Okay. So the town one's gone. And now we can just... I guess you could just Draco and then go for a knockoff. Just double into it. Um. Ooh. Not bad. I never saw an item for the Talon Flame. And we used knockoff. I didn't see it say anything. Oh, Incinera didn't even eat his berry yet. 
Good job, buddy. Good job, buddy. I, uh, you know. Okay, Duralodon. You could do it, buddy. Acrobatics. Okay, there we go. Stay from over getting the KO here. Getting the KO. I didn't think Flash Cannon would anyway. Um, very solid. Yeah, upper hand, Tailwind, and then we just saw Acrobatics. So I'm not too sure what the last move on it was or what the item was. Hmm. Let's take a look. Um, after that, when I when I edit this, see if anything proc because. I was just pretty scared of the Dragapult, but I mean, I guess with Staple Remover in the back, it was very nice because we always had like that, the Draco. Um, getting rid of the Mammoth Swine. Very solid. What a good battle. Very high, very high. Ooh, Ogre Pawn. Ogre Pawn Water. Articuno. Fluttermane Whims. String cheese and a lowland night tails. They could go. <laughs> this one's got maybe like shenanigans. They may lead a lowland night tails because the Articuno um, would benefit from it. They can get uh, Veil up. So if they're starting with nine tails. What do you want to do? We want to make sure if there's Whimsicott there, we don't get locked into things. Hmm. I do think we can just go Staple Remover Torn. We try and get a Tailwind set up, or we just go for a Bleak Wind. Um, with how many special attackers there are, I don't see a need for a Moongus. Um... Ogre Pond kind of scares me away from Urshifu, though. <clears throat> but we can go Landorus because it's got Sludge Bomb. Help out against uh, quite a bit of stuff. And then I think we'll go Incineroar. I think we'll actually leave. Incineroar could have been a good a good lead, too. Um, we could always go... Well, let's see what they lead. Because if they lead Whimsicott, we can always either Tailwind or Rain Dance with Torn. And then swap into Incin. Because, yeah, I feel like they may Tailwind. Uh, Whimsicott could probably have Sash. This, like, Fluttermane, Whims, or Ninetales. Like, that's three months I could have Sash. So, Whims could be Covert Cloak. Do we just want to go for the Tailwind? Or do we just want to protect? Torn could go down right now. I think I think we'll utilize having a Tailwind. Yeah, so they go for Tailwind. We will match that. String Cheese probably goes for a Make It Rain. Um, knocking out the Torn. Oh, they're just going for a Nasty Plot. Uh, that's scary. And Whims is Sash. <sighs> okay, that's scary. That is... Scary. How... How are we gonna handle... They go for a make it rain. I mean, I think Duraludon would be okay. I think we just still flash cannon this and then we'll swap into Incineroar. Uh, I don't want to be Encore. We don't know if the Swim Scout has Encore. Um, and then we can kind of threaten a knockoff. Yeah, there's the Encore. You're just going for another nasty plot. Oh my, this Golden Go is going to absolutely... We're putting too much into trying to knock out that Whimsicott. 
Because this golden ghost is gonna make it rain and there's every time. Now they gotta follow me. Now they gotta follow me, shenanigans. Hmm. We could fake out and see. Spiky shield, okay. And you're just gonna protect. Oh, I do not like this. I do not like how we have let this golden go set up. We each still have one more turn of talent, right? Yeah. Huh. Paragrass isn't gonna do a thing. This Ivy Cudgel and Center War. I think we just go for the knockoff. Oh, Pango, please follow me. Oh, you're just gonna shadow ball. You're tr you're gonna be keeping all your boost. <laughs> Dylan, I'm sorry. That's up like a plus four. <clears throat> Whew, okay. We could get a Talon up again. Would... The thing is... I don't know if we would be faster. I don't know if we should just Rain Dance. Let's see. Let's Tailwind and Flare Blitz. They're gonna Terra. There's String Cheese. Terra Steel. Okay. Which, I mean, we went for the Flare Blitz, but if they're going for the Make It Rain, I think they're, I think they're clearing the field. I think they're clearing the field. Let's see. Okay, we are faster. Oh. Ow. Why? Yeah, there's a thing. Yeah. I wish our Flare Blitz would have let us... Like, we would have gotten, um... Would have been able to get her berry, but, like... It was a golden ghost, big boost then. Uh, we can't go for Sansir Storm. And see how that goes. Terra Poison, how do we feel about that? Probably pretty decent. And we'll Sansir. Um, they still do have one more Mon, either Articuno Fluttermane or Alolan Ninetales. We did play around the Whimsicott on Torshenangan, so I'm proud of that. Um, Oakrun to follow me. Very fine, as we're gonna try and sand Seer and hit both. Landris hit both. Landris hit none. <laughs> All right, Lando. We tried. I wonder. Sand Seer on Terra Steel. Strange cheese. I want to know the damage. I wonder if we were able to hit that and get the knockout. Um, would that have... Uh, would that have been what we wanted to do? Because we knew that the Ogre Pond was going to go for, like, follow me shenanigans. Um, most likely, I didn't want to go for the Earth Power. Because, yes, it would have knocked out the Ogre Pond. But then we would have for sure... Uh, <laughs> we would have for sure gotten knocked out by by the String Cheese. So, that was the play that we, we could do. But I think, you know... 
it's the end of the week. Let's let's get a fifth battle in here. Let's see. We're we're what two and two. Let's let's see how this fifth battle goes. All right. Oh oh, just save her for a second. I was like, oh, is Dragonite here as well? Okay, so Fluttermane, Torn, Saberilla, uh, Hisui and Arcanine, which we have not seen in a while, and Urshifu. Hmm. You know, I feel like going Torn, Staple Remover. Is pretty solid. Now what scares that is Arcanine. Arcanine also is intimidate, but um, draw it on special types. So we don't care about that. I think. Do we want to go? I mean, we could have Lando. Which could be kind of nice. And then Incineroar. Incineroar could be good for any like swap-ins for Intimidates. Um, if they've already used their Terra, we do have knockoff on the Fluttermane. Um, and we possibly save our Terra for the Incin if we... What is Torn? So Torn's Terra Steel. Um... Instant. Okay, so you know, Torn Urshifu. We're going Torn Saber Remover. We think they're going Tailwind. We can offset the Tailwinds by one. Duraludon's not really going to be that fast anyway. Um, they could Rain Dance. So we could just go for a Bleak Wind. We need to get rid of this. Urshifu. Ugh. Okay, detect there. Okay, they're gonna tail one. So here, they can either go for Bleak Wind and... I think we gotta... I think we gotta go for... I mean, we don't necessarily need to go for Tailwind. We just go for Bleak Wind again. We'll go for Bleak Wind. And then we'll just go for body press on the Urshifu. You're gonna taunt us, that's fine. Tamwin taunt. Okay. Scary as can be. We hit the bleak one on both. Next out Urshifu. Um, we do body press the torn. We're at plus one defense. <laughs> oh, it's Rocky Helmet Torn. Oh my, okay. Well, you know, Saber Remover, you put in as much work that you could do. We're going into... We'll go into Incineroar. They're going into their also their Firemon, their Arcanine. <sighs> we unfortunately cannot Rain Dance. Their Arcanine is faster, but they've set up Tailwind. We have not. We have not. 
so we're kind of stuck in a bleak wind, but that's okay. I do think we want to tear a water incineroar. Mm, we don't necessarily need to yet. We can just fake out the Arcanine. Don't want to fake out uh, Torn because uh, it has a Rocky Helmet. Yes, so Arcanine flinches. Our Torn goes, hits the bleak one, knocks out there. It's beautiful. Get in those two speed drops, even though. They may have Tailwind set up. We've hit two Bleak Wind Storms. That we've gotten the speed drop on both. And Saber's the last one. Okay. I do want a Terra Incineroar. Uh, we're still taunted for one more turn. Do we think? Mm. Okay, so we're gonna see about a bleak wind, right? I'm gonna tear a water, and we're gonna flare blitz saber. Saber might protect, right? Um, they have not terrored either. Ooh, this one kind of closed. Terra Ensign. Only because I don't want a Sacred Sword going into us. I don't want. Yeah, there's some protect. Rock Slide. Tailwind's down. I'm gonna set up a Tailwind. And then we're gonna attack the Saber. They protected last turn. I feel like they're sashed with Saber. Um, their Arcanine might be Assault Vest. Bleak one's not doing much of them. I know they resisted, but... There's their Terra. What Terra are you with? Terra Poison. Okay. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that because oh, it's life orb. Okay. Get our berry. We get talent up, so Ensign should be going next. I was hoping. That doesn't do as much as I was hoping. Okay. Alright. So, rock slides can miss. We have Lando here. We can go into an Earth Power and Arcanine. Saber may protect. I feel like we just go for the earth power. And we'll parting shot this. If Saber decides to... Okay. That's okay. Sacrifice this so much. <sighs> okay. I think we just have to go for the earth power. And the flare blitz. He sucker punches one of us. Okay. Sucker punches neither of us. Mm. This is such a close one. Like, Earth Power gets a knockout. Flare Blitz should also get the knockout. So, I think we're okay.
I mean, Incineroar will knock itself out with from recoil. But yeah, Flare Blitz should get that knockout. And we'll have a clear field. So I think Incineroar's on eight. Couldn't be any closer. Ooh. Oh, what a battle. What a battle. What a way to end off this this week's battles with um, with the staple remover. Put an absolute work. We get to see we did get to see some more of Lando today, uh, which was nice. Um very hype. The team the team is super fun. I enjoy it. We even got to, you know, see a little bit of shenanigans with Amoongus. Um so that is that's very nice cuz Amoongus is like I'm on that that I don't really use, so I'm glad we got to utilize it um, this week. Not necessarily today, but uh, it, it put in its work uh, the last video. Um, but yeah, that's that's it for today. Hopefully you all enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to leave a like. I'm not too sure what team we'll test next week. Charlotte Regionals is this weekend, um, so I'll definitely be uh, watching the stream, keeping on that, seeing about any um, cool teams that look uh, fun to test out, or we'll take a look at a Portland team or something. Um, but yeah, until then, be cozy.